If you'd like to play Siamese Mahjong and you have a set at home, practice playing hands by doing an exercise that I call Siamese Force. I have strips for every category on the card and since you play two hands at one time with Siamese Mahjong, we'll grab six random strips and force hands in those categories. Since it's a new card, this is a really great way to practice. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Let's do some Siamese Force. Winds and Dragons, consecutive run, two, four, six, eight, quince, singles and pairs, odds, we got our work cut out for us here. Let's just say we're the dealer for these exercises. I'll take 28 random tiles for that. Okay, three flowers, pair of white dragons, some winds, and a, including a pair of yeasts. Then here we have six, eight, nine in pairs. Here's a two, three, five. So I do see some three, six, nine potential. I see year potential. So let's look at 369 first. Three six nine. And then maybe the year. A lot of joker bait right there let's see we might be able to use these year tiles up here I know there are some mixed suit options there's even a year with news whoops so we've got four discards with joker bait Let's see about the hands themselves though. For the year, there's one hand with four flowers, one suit. That is a pretty nice potential there. We've got eight tiles towards that hand. That would be the third one down. Then as an option though, I would keep the one in the eight because there is a potential here for the first 2018 hand, 2018, three suits. I would keep those. Then for, let's see here, I would even keep this these wins because there is news with 2018 and one suit right here as a matter of fact I would hold that let's see if we can do a 369 with flowers 
So let's look at 369. There's one, uh, two hands with with 369 and flowers. One of them uses jo uh, dragons. So I don't think that would be a good one. That would be the first one. But there is one with two flowers, 369 and one suit right there. 369 one suit there is a three six nine in mixed suits three six we need nine dots there's a big gap there i don't think that would be a good potential there though let's see here what i am thinking is maybe the year hand would be better and that way maybe we could leverage all the three six nine here there is a 369 pair hand. 3693. 369 pair hand, third from the bottom. Pair of flowers. 369 in pairs. 369 in another suit in pairs. We have a gap, which is not really a good thing, but this would leave us with nine discards, which is not bad. I would still hold these for the year to potentially play news with the year and start by discarding these four and hold those for joker bait. That's how I would play this. So we have singles and pairs down here and you know what? All that time I'm playing the year there's no year up there so let's do winds and dragons let's see here singles and pairs and joker bait East and West with twos or East and West with dragons. East and West with twos is second from the bottom. And then there's East and West with dragons and flowers. Of course we would need, oh, green dragons only. Nope, green dragons only, not as flexible. But there is news with dragons. That's a potential as well. So yeah, I think this is still doable, even though we have a little bit more joker bait. So wins and dragons, singles and pairs. This one down here, even though there's a gap, if we get that gap filled, this could be a winner. Not bad. If you would do something differently with these tiles, write force one and what you would do differently. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, here we go. We gotta make consecutive run, evens, quince, odds. Probably not gonna be doing a quint here. Probably not. Okay, so look at all these wins here. So we need to do consecutive run, quince, evens, odds. There's no news in consecutive, evens, or odds. The only thing we could do here would be a quince with no jokers. Eventually you would have jokers during pick and discard, but these would all have to go away. If we're gonna force hands, 
all those wins have to go away. Okay, consecutive run, five, six, five, six, seven, eight, nine, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. That would be the, let's see here, fourth one down. Five, six, seven in pairs, eight, nine. That would use one, two, three multiples, which is pretty nice. Then down here, I see one, two, three, four, or little odds. One, two, three, four. We have no fives. The five is up here. Six, seven. We could do six, seven, eight, nine and use the five down here. Six, seven, eight, nine. That would be the second hand down. And then six, seven, eight, nine. I would hold these up here too, just in case six, seven, eight, nine comes in. And then down here, one, three, one, two, three, five, one, one, three, five. Probably get rid of that. So we would have five discards with joker bait there. Let's see. There is a one, three, five, seven, nine potential. Let's just see. One, three, five, seven, nine. The second from the bottom. One, three, five in pairs. Kongs of sevens and Kongs of nines. I don't think we have enough nines. I think I, I'd rather do one, three, five. There's even a potential here with the dragon. One, three, five dragon where the middle number matches the dragon. That's a potential. I would hold that. Then we have one, one, three, one three three five that would be the second hand down so there's lots of potential here these ones i don't know if those are going to be useful unless we switch to like numbers with ones one two three four five six versus one two three four five or one two one two three four five i think like numbers is probably more likely than little odds, but I would hold it all. I think this is what I would do. And up here, if I had to pick a hand, six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight, nine, right here. Six, seven, eight, nine, second hand down. But I wouldn't pick a hand. I would stay flexible because there are all kinds of things you can do until you run out of discards, gather six, seven, eight, nine. Every six, seven, eight, nine, regardless of suit and even dragons if you can, because there are two hands there that do, that use dragons. So this is how I would play it. We have consecutive and odds. Consecutive and odds. I just noticed the two, four, we have six, eight, eight, two, four. If we had a four BAM, we could maybe even do the two, four, six, eight pair hand. Two, four, six, eight pair hand. Let's just count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight tiles. I think there's a lot more flexibility here. There's 10 tiles that would be a lot more flexible, but I think I would go ahead and hold that for a little while. Get rid of these first, then these six, seven, eight, nine, or two, four, six, eight pair hand, in which case we could use this up here too. And then little odds or like numbers with ones. As far as forcing the hands and winning a prize, I think consecutive run and odds.
That's how I would work it. If you would do something different, write force two in the comment section and how you would use these tiles differently. Let's see if we can do quince and evens next. No jokers. No jokers. We got to do a quint. Okay. Let's see what happens. We need, well, first let's do 2468. I do see 2468 potential here. So here's two, four, eight, right there. There's a four. There's six and eight. So there's two, four, six, eight potential right there. Oh, there's a two. Two, four, six, eight. One, three. We need quince. One, three. One, three wins. Wins and dragons. This is what I would do. Two, four, six, eight, quint. The way this one would work is chock full of joker bait. Wait for jokers. That would be the plan here. Watch the board. Whatever goes down, get rid of it. Collect more dragons. Try to get jokers, of course. As far as the 2468, there's 2468. There's some mixed suit options in here. I would not pick a hand. If I had to pick a hand, we have no flowers, so I wouldn't try for the pear hand. Plus, we want to get a prize, so we need to stay in the 2468 category. We could do potentially 2468 white dragon. We have no white dragon, and we would want to use those maybe with the quint. I think the 2468 second from the bottom would be a good possibility. If we get dragons, we could even maybe use the dragons up here for a one suit option. Okay, that's what I would do. I would try to force quince with no jokers. That's kind of my signature move, you know. Two, four, six, eight, and quince. Let me know what you think about Siamese force. And if you would do anything differently for these, write force one, two, or three, and what you would do differently. Everybody sees something differently, and I'm sure I've probably missed a few, especially with a new card. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, click subscribe. And then click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos. That way you won't miss any opportunities to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an inside of the game that will give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Siamese Force for American Style, may all your picks be keepers.